Hello and welcome. This is Ageless John playing Frost in Fallout 4. As you can tell, I am no longer in my armor. What I've done is I've uh, went back to uh, the old casa and dropped off the armor in my wooden bird and then came back here. I actually left my stuff uh, here in the cache location because it was actually more than I could carry safely in my whirly bird. Uh, I can carry the stuff in the whirly bird, but I still get anyway. I still get damaged whenever I move, possibly. So um, I decided just to leave it in the cache and then fly back, go back to home, drop off the armor, and then come back here. So here we are, going back to explore the interior. Huh. Notch for the gun. Am I? Sounds like somebody's done some damage to somebody. Good riddance. Let's go uh, see who we can catch. Okie dokie. Oh! oh. oh. <laughs> yeah, that was... <laughs> Let's try this again. Um... So somebody's in there fighting. Let's take a personal impact grenade, plasma grenade. Whoa! Shoot him in the head. Wow. Okay. Some more uh, armor there. Oh! Oh! Um. Yeah, I may not be able to do this. Oh! See. Oh! I got shot in the head. That's like the worst place you can get shot. Uh, another fragment grenade. Somebody got knocked off. And somebody else got knocked off. Let's see if I've got a trauma kit or something that'll take care of this. Wow, I kind of wasted a lot of bullets on that, but you know what? Uh, this is not healing my head. No, it's not. Talk on it. Maybe this one. Nope. Um, I hate being hit in the head. Um, that's junk. Night vision. Did I just kill everybody? I think I did. Oh, all right. Well, we're going to have to give a once through in here to see if there's anything really cool worth picking up. And I have a feeling I'm going to make it a trip outside to the uh, Ah, let's play this one. Word Probably. came down that the army just unloaded the first batch of the uh, M42s this morning. Yeah, I've only seen the specs for these little beauties on paper. Vanilla. So Private Bertram and I snuck down to take an early look. When I heard that the eggheads were designing a manned portable nuke launcher, I thought they were nuts. But they actually got the damn thing to work. And after seeing the real thing sitting right in front of me, I think they could be just enough to tip the balance of this war in our favor. I mean, can you imagine the look on the enemy's face when we get dropped into Anchorage carrying these babies? They won't know what hit them.
One of the things that I've got is a mod that installed that allows me to restore frames for uh, armor. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to try to restore the frame. Ghost Black. It doesn't, right, it doesn't happen instantly. It takes a little bit of time, which I appreciate. Bingo. And then you have the armor, which I can now enter. No power. Ah, uh, yeah. Well, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go outside and I'm going to put all this stuff in the cache and then come back here and there's one more room I want to explore. Plus, I think I can go downstairs and upstairs and check those out. But I got I to gotta get this back to the house. Well, I dumped everything off at the cache to be picked up by my settlers. Uh, I did realize that I have actually been here before. I forgot that. Um... This is part of the, ooh, nice, part of the uh, Join the Brotherhood of Steel quests line, I guess, because they sit there, I remember being dropped off here on a black flight suit, huh, from a helicopter and then having to fight a whole bunch of greenies, um, but apparently the greenies have all been replaced by uh, ghouls and remnants. Let's see if we can get in here and find anything cool. Yes. If I sound a little weird, I am... I mean, I can apologize, but uh, I'm, I'm sick. I'm actually fairly ill. Um, so today is not... Uh, not the best day for this, and for that reason, this may also be a uh, somewhat short episode. As I intend to finish exploring all this area, loot it, drop it off. Uh, ooh, a nice. nice sneaker? Yes! More difficult to detect while sneaking. I need those. Uh, call on my birdie bird and then go home and take care of my head wound. Because apparently I don't have what it needs to uh, to heal the head wound. Uh, so I'll have to get medevaced out for that. So let's go upstairs and see if there's anything there. So I apologize in advance if this is shorter than normal. Ooh, well that's not bad. There's some stuff up here. I'm hoping that one of these things will contain another really good schematic. Doesn't look like it though. Those aren't too bad. They're very rare. Um. there. I know there it looks like there was more. I did not come in here. Let's take the banded scissors uh, just for... I def don't think I ever have, so... No, I have. The newness is worn off. Ah, there's some more upstairs. Whiskey is always good, especially after a wanton killing of other humans. Uh, ah, there we go. Scalvage that. Crystal's always good. Form of hat's got cloth in it. I don't really need more cloth, but I picked it up anyway because it's not very heavy. Eh. Just because it's a military hat. Nice. 
could actually sleep here. I'm wondering if sleeping here would solve my head wound issue. I don't know. Let's try it and find out. It did, in fact, heal me, so uh, that's awesome. So now I don't have to med it back out. Uh, checked everything here. Let's go back downstairs. Yeah, the I didn't see the elevator. I have a feeling that, that uh, the author... Yeah, there it is. Yeah, the author blocked it off. Yeah, there's not another way to get over there. Yeah, it's it's blocked off. He does not want us going going there, so I can respect that. So, we'll go back outside. Run over here and check to see if my cache is still here. That's where I dropped my frame off. It is still up. Good. Drop some other extra toys off. New weapons I picked up. I mean, it doesn't look very different. But it is the extended ripper. Which is still very fast, and uh, does a little bit more damage than the Hooked Ripper. I think it's actually the most upgraded Ripper that you can get, so... It should give me even more killing room with uh, those dirty, or rotten ghouls. And there's my power armor. Frame, at least. Uh, I'm gonna leave it here. Uh, and, you know... Theoretically speaking, I will come back and pick it up with my birdie bird. Because, you know, I can fly here, drop it off, because it's been cleared out. Uh, and then come back, uh, pick it up, walk slowly over to my birdie bird, get on, and go home. So, that wouldn't be terribly difficult. So, I am now going to head over to here, and then go along the coast... Hmm, let me see. I've not actually gone along this bit of the coast. Yes, I have, because I've... Nordigan Beach, I swam across from here to here. So, <clears throat> realistically speaking, I should go up the beach, Nordigan Beach, swim across, and then continue from, uh, from that area, because I don't think there's going to be a lot around the airport area. Oh, there are my settlers stuck under the snow. That's that's an interesting bug. Oh, there they are. Going around. Huh? Salvaging my stuff. Awesome. Yes. So I'm uh, heading that direction. And I will swim across. Hey, puppy. We'll have to see if I find any bad guys. There shouldn't be any bad guys up here because I've already cleared out the airport. But look at this weather. You can't see anything. It's not fun exploring when you can't see anything. Huh. Oh, okay. Mutt crap. Should have been on the lookout for those. Where is it? Where is it? Okay. Let's look at my map. And this pretty much goes out here and then ends. But I want to go out here and end and just see what there is to see. Somebody was thinking the same thing. A little desolate island. A little sunken boat. Anything on board the sunken boat? <gasps> Anything of interest? No, just a sunken boat. <gasps> Alright. Well, my voice is actually beginning to go, 
So let's walk over here and follow this just a little bit farther. Because I see through the mist there's something there. I need a hand bottle. What? Huh. Oh, there it is. Messes in a bottle. Read. I thought I ate a fish today. It didn't taste right. And then I realized while writing this that I ate my own hand. I think I'm losing it. Okay. Huh. Interesting. Um. Okay, it gives me a point out there. Well, now we have something to do in the next episode. Uh, until then, this is H's John playing Frost in Fallout 4, and I'll see you around next time.